All right. So this is part two of my AVG Internet Security 9 video. The computer booted back up after it half crashed. Um, if we look at this, because I'm getting a little exclamation point there. I want to know if it actually removed the malware or whether it actually crashed and didn't do any removal. So it says I'm protected and there's nothing to do. And it automatically checks for updates. The update failed. Whoops. I forgot to connect my network card. So I'm gonna try that one more time. Well, I know it. I know it updated. So here we go. No update. So. Let's go back to our links. I have to figure out where we were. I believe we left off right here. So I'm going to continue here. So it, it found a threat, and it blocked the threat. So I'm assuming this was the web guard that found this because it couldn't even get the file information via the browser. This is, um, I believe, a roguish application. Oh yeah, it failed last time. I should have remembered that. So this is a exploit. I'm going to bring up the task manager. I don't see anything loading in here. All I notice is that AVG seems to be running a ton of processes. I'm going to leave this open because the next couple, because I have a few more exploits and we can check in the task manager as we go along. This is a Trojan. By the way, Bitdefender missed almost all of these. I'm not noticing anything from AVG. So if we look in our task manager, bingo, we have 37 processes. Something here is not legit. I don't see it. But I have to assume that it started a process and it's wreaking havoc in the computer. Just a simple piece of malware nowadays. Okay, it already blocked it. So if I try to run it, nothing should happen. Okay. Malware is so bad you can download one piece and the whole computer has... 30 infected files on it, and it can be a hell to clean off. So this is an exploit. Applet started. It's trying to do something. I don't see anything loading on either. I have not had luck with real exploits lately. All right, this is a file. This is a Trojan file. And 
So, this is like one of the least detected things I've ever seen. It has the McAfee symbol, so great, you think it's McAfee or something. It's Antivirus Pro 2010, which is a pain in the neck. So I'm going to create a permanent rule, and I'm going to block, because I know it's not good. So this is going to sit here like this for the rest of the day, so I'm going to close that out. This is an exploit. Again, I don't see much loading in. Actually, I don't see anything loading in. So this one is a well-known... Yeah, okay. It's a Trojan TDSS. That's the, that's the real name. This calls it a Trojan Packet Hidden. Um whatever you want to make of that but I'm noticing it's back down to 36 so if it, there was malware it stopped using a process and it's installed the rootkit or whatever and well whatever it's done running as a process so this here I don't see anything loading either um it was supposed to load something. I believe it loaded something earlier. At least I thought so. But it doesn't seem to be doing it now. I have more time in this video. So I'm going to pull up some more links. Because I can. And see if we can actually make AVG crack to something. Because I haven't necessarily said it's broken except for one file. So I'm going to find some more links and then I'll be right back. So I got three more, three more things. If AVG blocks these, I will have to give it to them that they have definitely upped their protection quite a bit. They supposedly did work a lot in their heuristics and everything. This is a GIF. A malicious image. Okay, that's great. It's found malware. And it blocked the exploit. Now, I meant to copy this. This is a new... Korean rogue and it's in the virus vaccine family so it is new and I'm interested to see if AVG detects it wow if I could read that I'd be amazed I'm assuming that was the accept button Just because I'm curious, I want to see what this is, I'm going to allow it. Save my answer. Gosh, I don't want to get that pop up anymore. So this is one last EXE before I run out of time. So it found another threat. And we'll quarantine that one. And it needs me to restart again. So we'll leave it at that. It's going to restart and remove that malware. So. Whoa. I'm going to take some screenshots of this. This looks cool. So, um. Thanks for watching. AVG detected everything except two things. So that's pretty good for AVG compared to Bitdefender's success, which you can see in my other video. Thanks for watching. Goodbye.